Oh man, it's shot in high definition as well, which makes it even worse. I'm going to turn the volume up. I was going to put headphones on, but I didn't. But we'll put up a limit. I mean, Larry Wills is massive as well, isn't he? <laughs> Jeez, mummies, that's a lot of weight too. Oh, I'm actually terrified about this. Simon the Board A-Hole here. Thank you very much for joining me as always. Joe, the fitness mascot, Stanley, the Gange giraffe. This is kind of one of those situations where, look, Ryan Crowley obviously is in a far worse position than I am. I'm not going to try and pretend otherwise. But if you watch my channel a lot, we do a lot of reaction videos. We watch gym people, always hoping that they're okay and, and so on and so forth. So when this happened over the weekend, I was just very kindly, in a weird way, inundated with people saying, Millie, go see this. Go see blah, 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 blah. Now, loads of people have made videos uh, for it. I had other stuff to do this weekend, so sadly, I've only been able to get around to it now. Always annoying. In the future, I'm going to make sure I jump on this stuff more quickly. Before we get anywhere, though, obviously, Ryan Crowley is bodybuilder. You may have seen this already. I haven't, obviously, because I want to watch it with you. He has completely torn his pec. I've seen one of the pictures on Instagram, so I know how bad it is, but he has a GoFundMe, and I think we are going to talk about this kind of video. We should talk about the GoFundMe to help do his surgery. I think he's already smashed through his goal, but still, I'm going to make sure I throw some money in there. Only seems fair if we're going to do videos like this for it. But if you can help him, please do. But yes, as far as I can understand, he was lifting, I think it's five plates on each side. Again, this is all from what people have sent me saying, Miller is doing this, Miller is doing that. I'm guessing he's going for a one rep max, or at least going for some kind of personal best. And I suppose... This brings into a whole, we've talked about it here on the channel before, this brings into a whole other debate about the rise of YouTube, the rise of social media, the rise of trying to get attention, the rise of trying to get a reaction. I mean, the irony of that. And I completely understand it. We're all vying for clicks, we're all vying for success. And this, the internet is a great way to try and do that. But remember, I mean, maybe it's a bit different for Ryan. It, it is a bit different for Ryan. He's a pro bodybuilder. He knows what he's doing. He had Larry Wills around him. You know, this is a pretty badass team. And he still got injured. So I know you haven't tuned in to watch a PSA, and I'm certainly not your dad. Or so maybe I am. Who knows? Maybe something crazy is going to happen down the line but just always be careful right always be safe it's not worth getting a billion well, have you got a billion jillion views on youtube yeah but getting a few extra views to go through whatever this is is probably not worth it so let's just hit play the video will start the video will pop up on screen and we will react to this and again they're talking about the gofundme right there and uh, apparently larry's done a statement as well so oh man it's shot in high definition as well which makes it even worse i'm gonna turn the volume up. i was gonna put headphones on but i didn't but we'll put up a limit I mean, larry wills is massive as well isn't he <laughs> Jeez, mummies, that's a lot of weight too. Oh, I'm actually terrified about this. Oh, I was as bad as I thought. It was as bad as I absolutely thought. Oh, can you imagine? Can you actually imagine? Oh, good, we get another one, do we? Look at me trying to hide away like... You actually see it tear. I mean... Oh, shish kebab. The human body is... Yeah, this is Larry talking about the, 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 the GoFundMe. Again, I'll make sure I put a link in the description. I'll forget. Remind me, then I'll put it in. It's because I'm an idiot. Oh, I mean... <laughs> I've watched a lot of Jim Fell videos, right? Not saying that's a fail. I'm just using the term that everybody uses. I mean, you actually... I know, we shouldn't probably do this, but I mean, just as an idea. I mean, we've seen it now. Once the, you know, the, the, the box is open, you know, once you've gone into the woods, you can't go out. I mean, look at that. Oh, shit. I just don't know what to do. And the way his body contorts as well. I, again, I don't want to be your dad, but you've got to be careful. Think about when you're under a leg press, right? That could crush you. Just go one plate less. <laughs> you train harder the last time. Yeah, smash it. Be intense. But you know, it's not worth this. Nothing is worth an injury. And obviously, we'll make sure we put the pictures on the screen. I mean, I don't know how long this was afterwards, but it couldn't have been more than 24 hours, right? It's been like, I broke my finger recently. I've taken my thing off today because I felt like it needed to breathe. I still can't move them. But even with something as minor as that, right, in comparison, you know when you've done something bad because the bruise comes up within a seconds and it's the same with the same with tearing your pec you may remember when triple h tore his pec when he was doing that saudi arabia match i think teaming with Shawn michaels taken on the undertaker and kane he posted pictures of it sort of within hours and it's just this purple bluey mess i'll make sure i get a picture of that on the screen as well tearing your pec, pec is is no joke and triple h finished the match somehow because all wrestlers are crazy i don't know how they do that i mean how on earth i mean you can't see it anymore i'm looking at it here still how oh i mean i don't know how much weight that is i don't know if he's lifting 50 pound weights or whatever but that's a hell of a lot of weight i mean it's a big dude right you know he's a, he's a flipping flipping big dude it just goes to show how frail the body is. Now I sound like someone's going to come around your house and knock on the door like, oh, life is so frail, please, and probably ask you to give me some money. I'm not going to do that. I don't have anything else to say about this. <laughs> it's just, it's unreal. It's unbelievable. It can happen though, right? So always make sure you're warming up, making sure you're warming down. Make sure you're comfortable with the weight you're lifting, even when you've got a spotter. And I totally get it. These guys are in a different league, so it maybe doesn't apply to them, even though he did get injured. But uh, I'll end my PSA there. It's like watching everyone say by the bell. Do you remember that? Back in the day, somebody would get addicted. It, wasn't, it was never to drugs. Tangent. 
It was always something like they got addicted to caffeine pills. That's it, Jesse's banner. I remember this. Got addicted to caffeine pills. He was just freaking out and saying, like, oh, Jesse. There's never any time. I don't have time to study. I'll never get into Stanford. I'll let everyone down. I'm so confused. Yeah, then afterwards, they'd be like, don't get addicted to caffeine pills. And what they wanted to say is don't do coke. That's what they were trying to say. Don't do cocaine. Cocaine is really bad for you. And I bet you, of all the other uh, reaction videos you may have watched to this, I bet nobody finished it talking about Coke. But hey, I like to think it all tied in. Let's wrap it up. So as always, please do leave a comment below. Uh, like the video, share the video, subscribe. Subscribing would be the number one thing I'd ask you to do. It's fun when that number goes up. As we are talking about subscriptions, actually, shout out to Greg Doucette, who smashed through a million subscribers over the weekend. What an inspiration and what a YouTube powerhouse that man is. So, you know, a salute to Greg. I'm sure he'll be up at 2 million in no time. And also, when you pass the 1 million sub barrier, you've done it. It doesn't even matter what else you've done now. You are among the elite. So hell yeah, congratulations to Greg. Uh, hit the bell, ding ding, then you know when other videos are going live. I'll put another Jim Fell reaction video right there. So if you get a weird kick out of this, <laughs> you can carry it on on this Monday. Otherwise, I lied, I am going to ask for your money. Patreon.com forward slash Simon316 if you do want to support financially. Otherwise, just to follow on Instagram or Twitter would be awesome. Simon316. What's the other thing we got? Merchandise, simon.bigcartel.com. As I say to everyone, new merchandise will come in when I sell the old stock. So keep an eye on there in the next couple of days for a sale, as long as I get around to it. But otherwise, I appreciate your eyes. I appreciate your ears. I appreciate you tuning in. Still can't believe how bad that was. Again, be safe in the gym. Be, you know, training hard is really important, but it's not worth your health. Again, health and fitness. What's the most important word that we underline and bold and shine up? Health. If you haven't got your health, you haven't got anything else, and I'll see you on the next one.